So update 3.0 is out and there's been tons of changes. So it's exactly what's coming. So we've got, so with 3.0 update, we've got Lunar New Year. So this is a Lunar Candle, which I'll go for in a second. Plus you've got the Guardian Boons, which is revamped, Guardian revamp and Milestone Ascension to 10K. So one step at a time, first the Milestone Ascension. So this little icon here it used to be up to 4K, but now it's up to 10K. So you can see you got loads of milestones. Let me know how far you've gotten so far. I'm currently at 3,813. Um, obviously get bonuses even more. So let me know in the comments below what yard you've hit. Now we've go to the lunar board. Happy new uh, Lunar New Year. So how do you play? You obtain dice for tapping on coins to get dice. Roll the dice to travel the board. Each time you travel the board, if you complete a section, you get uh, set bonus rewards. So you get these for each section you complete. So if you complete one section, you get one and up to five. When you pass through the you pass through the gates, this bit you get more dices, and there's also fun games. For example, pick a card, random dice, which gives you like double dice and extra features. Now, each time you cap, um, each time you do a full lap, it counts, and each time you do certain counts, you get these rewards. So, 30 laps gets you the adorable buns for Pixie, and if you keep going, you get loads of uh, like chests, runes, rewards, charms. It is for lots, but 200 you get the king's costume and you also get legendary mask 190 so it's worth collecting them so when you roll a dice the numbers add up and when you get to 100 you get 15 it's not always 15 sometimes it's a different amount um, but you get 15 extra dice for doing 100 tiles so if you move 100 tiles for the amount of moves, you get these extra dice. Now, if you have got a Shining Pass, you do get extra. So Shining Pass doubles the dice rewards. And a Shining Pass is $7.99 a month. It's like a subscription, but you don't just get double bonus. You also get 100 crystals, three fate tokens, um, three daily uh, divine transcendence. That basically gives you double arcana when you, when you transcend. So that's if you've got the Shining Pass as a monthly description you basically get more stuff which is quite handy uh, this is quite a fun event i do like this as one of the events uh, you also get your claims so you get three 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 so you can get up to three dices if you watch adverts or you can spend some diamonds um, if you want to get some extra dices there five or twenty five four thousand so there's a really fun game i like the luna now let's get into the boons. So if you go to Guardians, which is this one, this has changed completely. So if you click on this icon, which is top left, this goes to the Guardian boons. So you get these little shards, which is Guardian bonus powers. The If you collect a whole set, you get a multiplier bonus. So you can see their total power set multiplier times 90%, but you also get a bonus for each one you get as well. So if you get one of them, it goes up uh, percentages at a time i believe it's incremental like 10 20 13 and so forth for example this one i've got two so i've got 20 percent. this one's got one it's got one percent so this is guardian power bonus time 10 percent they go power bonus time 10 times 10 percent. so it all adds up um and you get multipliers for each one now these coins will appear on screen as you start progressing through the stages for different ones so purple green yellow and red now once you collected all of them the little orbs guardian orbs up here so all five of them it activates and as a bonus so it basically makes you um progress fast and get more power so each of them if you click on them tell you what what you can get so you get the phoenix spirit so for 15 seconds increases masker's damage by 400 percent gains additional 25 percent for each masketeer alive and if you get all of them, you get the Celestial Spirit. So for 15 seconds, gain all Guardian Spirit effects. Additionally, increases each Masketeer that's alive. So tap the five Guardian Spirits to summon the Celestial, uh, the celestial Spirit. So it's quite a good thing to get. Um, I've got zero full sets, but when you get the full set, you also get a, a new set bonus for when you complete all the sets. So this is just a fun way to help uh late game progression because at the moment uh, it was quite hard to progress when you get to a certain stage later and later but now with these you can keep collecting these shards these um, boons and it just is incremental power to just help you progress through the game a lot more quicker so you get these lying co coys for the dices so game to watch advert to collect the dices so these are the things i was on about so when you collect collect these guardian uh coys then it gives you an extra shard up there. And once you get all of them, it 
creates this celestial spirit. Um, now, the Guardian power themselves have, com have changed completely. So if you click on all three of these, um, you get different blessings and there's different ways to unlock. Now, if you want to know which blessings unlock and when, click on this icon at the top right, so this blue icon, and it'll tell you. So at level two, it unlocks Blazing Beak. Uh, then at level three, you get a Power Boon, but then at level four, you get Blazing Talons and so forth. So when you get to certain levels, say my next one at 15, I'll get a Power Boon, but then at 16, I'll get Power uh, Phoenix Strike. And if you want to click on them, uh, if you want to click on them to tell you what to do, it tells you exactly what the effects given so for example um on this one i get inferno charge which every fifth attack auto deals 100 percent extra damage and you can just basically select which one do you want to um set so you can only have four at a time but you can mix and match to say which ones you want to increase so this is quite good because this has got like it goes this goes up to like level 41 plus and you still collect uh power boons like way past high levels because obviously the uh, new it's not even capped at the milestone at 10,000 it's not stage cap that's just the bonuses you can level up way past 10,000 so it does help you to that late late game progression so that's the power boons you can there's other ways to get them as well not just by not by just collecting them as you as you level up your characters and increase the stages, there's several ways to collect the power boons. You collect the power boons, but as you just generally go through your milestones, as you level them up, you can go through that. You can also get them from I believe you can also get them as a transcendence reward. Um, I'm not I'm not a hundred percent sure, but I think I saw I saw it as it says guardian levels. So um I think I saw them as, as one of the roles when transcended, but I will leave it in the comments just to double check to be 100 percent sure. Now you also got these Lunar New Year cells, which is pretty cool. You basically you, on your first purchase, it gives you two free uh, freebies and then it's, it's like um, a higher purchase and then two more free rewards so you, when you first log in um, first pops up you will get two free rewards anyway and then you can spend 199 or whichever your local currency to get your wisps uh, and then there's two free rewards here which is either um, five dices and between 600 or 888 uh, crystals depending how lucky you're going to be but then if you spend four pound you then get again two more rewards before the next one so each one you spend it is more as it progresses higher and higher but you do get two free rewards afterwards i think i think it's a clever way of doing it it is getting you to spend money but you are getting something for it you are getting like a double bonus reward for it there's also uh the Tigress set for Felina. So if you want to spend 15, 16 quid, um, get a special limited edition set. So this is the mask and body, the whole set. So if you want to do that as well, it does change the the Ultima as well. But those are the main changes at the moment because you see like the activated, I like the effects they've got surrounding when you activated the Guardian, uh, the Guardian Boons and Spirits. They have like a little effect around the Mask of Tears, which I think is pretty cool. But I love the update they've done recently so the milestones tons of rewards they've made the guardian boons much more interesting so you got leveled these up and stacked all the effects uh they've also added the, the lunar table which is just fun to go for anyway uh yeah it's just just overall um i have liked it if there's anything specific you like them to still add or change let me know in the comments below and i can feed on to them see if you want to know exactly what all the changes were in the update it is on the instagram post which gives you exactly the information of the updates so the master extension guardian revamp uh, guardian boons and the lunar lunar new year event and there's also more events and more updates coming soon as soon as i know them i'll let you guys know i'll put a link to this uh description of all the updates in the description of this video so, so if you want to keep up to date with all the latest marketing with news guys tips and tricks make sure you're subscribed and hit the bell notification apart from that i hope you have a great day and i'll see you all in the next video take care bye